Hello everybody and welcome to May Day Media. We're pointing out some articles online. Uh, I've got a few articles here I think are pretty interesting. Um, we're going to go through them. I've read through them. I'm just going to point out some pieces of them that I think are pretty catchy. Um, if you find some of this stuff in interesting just go ahead and smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. A customized version of a canoe's electric delivery van for the USPS has been spotted in the wild. Now, from what I can understand, this is ugly as piss, right? It don't look like it's going to last the 20-something years like those aluminum ones they use now. They still use this. I remember when those were first on the street. God, that was like 2000. Um looks to have delivered at least one electric delivery van to one of its newest customers. I don't know nothing about this company. I mean, I've seen some stuff on it. Um, they better have something hybrid set up real soon because a lot of the battery stuff is going by the wayside. But we'll see. Uh, there's a part here I want to show you. And I couldn't believe all the fucking companies that are, excuse me, all the companies that is invested in this um where is it here i mean it went on and on where the hell is it put it right out there. Uh, here we go in recent years canoes has established several key customers including walmart king b nasa this past january canoe announced another notable name in its client list the usps in a petite deal of 190 delivered from canoe that are right hand drive but walmart king b nasa there's those are names i mean something about that somebody the ceo must know some fuckers i can tell you that because first of all this is an ugly ugly i mean look at this thing i mean i guess it looks right for delivering mail but it doesn't say anything about how long it, it it'll run off the batteries how big the batteries are i guess i could go look it all up but i ain't doing it um yeah i hope they have a hybrid set up in the future i mean you would think that the post office would want some kind of a hybrid instead of electric i mean they can they'd get better gas mileage less money and fuel i i would have been looking to a hybrid first thing instead of electric but I don't have infinite money of the taxpayers to spend. Here's this DeLorean concept. Now, I think this is pretty good looking here. It's got some nice little uh, P's and Q's on it. I mean, look at these lines. They're pretty. Uh, you know, most new cars just all look the same. It's like that Days uh, Thunder movie where they takes it in that barn. He puts that lathe over the top of that fucking race car and it fits perfect i mean that's like almost every car that comes out i mean they just look the same they're pretty ugly i mean and you can make these things attractive i mean just look at this car that is a good looking car uh i don't, I don't know why but i hope this is not a uh electric i'm, I'm really hoping this is going to be gasoline powered a rear engine uh, it's five six speed manual shit like that you know those kinds of options they, they've got a four door draw here I guess you call it a four door but I, I think they should stick with just a two door with the badass engine in the rear <laughs> you know like a vet baby I mean them gold wings look good this little picture here looks pretty good this might be the GM GM's interested in making the car for him. Apparently, she's not happy. The article I can't get to. It just wants me to subscribe. So, I can't read it. Here it is. Here, The daughter of the DeLorean Maverick plans a new car to redeem his legacy. She's not happy with it from what I understand. But, uh, it's not a bad looking car. Uh, just kind of something to keep an eye out for in case they do actually produce it. I think it'll be a big seller. Just if it if it's good looking and got a V8 and all the stuff you want. 476,000 year old ancient woodworking discovery rewrites early human history. This is way too long for us to get into. 
but these aren't humans these are uh, hominids they're uh, well before humans were around um, the type of stuff they're seeing is different from what they've seen before in this same time period um, so it could be some of the first movements of evolution maybe for some of the bigger brainers starting to pop up these stories do come along from time to time um, it's supposed to be I think in Africa savannah plains I, something I don't know yeah African savannah is where they find all the found this stuff 476,000 years ago NASA licensed 3D printable super alloy to benefit the US economy and yeah um, 3D printing I've been talking about for a long time. I've got a 3D printer. Uh, I think they're fascinating. I think the stuff you're going to be able to build with these uh, is going to be amazing, especially if you own the equipment, houses, uh, metal stuff, car stuff. I mean, just all the things you're going to be able to print. And some of the f these prints are looking pretty damn good. They they had another one that. Uh, it was just like injection molding, just as strong, just as, and that article came out. I don't think I ever put that article out, but it was, <laughs> it was been a while back, but in just another five years, what you're going to be seeing 3D printed is crazy. I think you're going to even see a lot more print farms open up in these locations that are empty. Um, great place if you're able to produce certain things there's two types of production there's democratic and uh, I can't remember the other one but one of them means you can make the stuff yourself the other one means you have to go through the company so if you could find those differences and be able to make a move on that I think you got something there <coughs> but also be for custom parts custom pipes <coughs> Uh, badass Star Trek model or something think about it there's a lot of stuff I think you'd be able to do with them They're, they made shoes I've seen some shoes that's been made flip flops they can do uh, Adidas has shoes I think in five years you'll start to see print shops pop up and you can go in there and order stuff and it'll be quality too Anywho, like, subscribe, till next time.